feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign, a sign Welcome back to FAQ The Madness. We respectfully exercise our First Amendment right to publish interactions with government officials through the unbiased view of a camera. Let's jump into another ref. Recording. What's up, everybody? It's your boy, FAQ The Madness. My name is Craig. I'm happy to be here with you. As I told you and as promised, I sent off some records requests. And originally, my goal is to to send out records requests. I decided that I was going to start with uh, the sheriff's department within North Carolina. There's 100 counties, 100 sheriff's departments. So that's a lot of public records requests that I can get going. I think that I'm going to be looking for types of uh, instances like uh, complaints against uh, officers, um, you know, for various reasons. I don't know. I But I started with with an email asking for certain information. I asked basically for reporting practices and procedures, including how reports are filed, stored, and made available to the public. Policies and procedures in place to ensure compliance with state and federal laws, including those related to constitutional rights and protections. Data or statistics on complaints filed against the department, including total number, nature, and outcome of complaints, broken down by race or ethnicity, of the complainant, where indicated. Records of body warm camera, BWC footage related to the above mentioned complaints, including any identifying information for the footage, uh, for example, case number, date, time, location, the outcome of any investigations or proceedings related to the footage. And finally, uh, records related to closed investigations of officer involved shootings and excessive force incidents within the requested time frame, including the nature and outcome of the incident and any disciplinary action taken or policy changes implemented as a result of the incident. So as we know, one of my uh, videos or two of my videos was at the uh, Pitt County Courthouse in Greenville, North Carolina. I had a very good uh, interaction with uh, Lieutenant Davis uh, and I posted that. Please check out that video, like and share um, if you will. Uh, Helps the algorithm, of course. So Having that in mind, I decided I was going to go to the uh, sheriff's departments that were most closely uh, uh, closest to me. I live in Pine Tops, uh, North Carolina, and it's it's th- there are a number of ones that are close to me. I think it's Halifax, Nash, uh, Pitt County, Wilson, and Edgecombe. So those five out of a hundred just give me a small sample of me trying to kind of refine exactly what it is I need to ask for. And that's what I did. So the first person that responded, uh, I had actually uh, Nash uh, responded. I made a couple of different calls and it turns out that the directory doesn't necessarily tell you exactly who you need to contact. And as we will see with this particular case, um, it's very possible that the person who I asked the questions of wasn't really the person who I need to speak with. So but we're gonna we're gonna figure that out, and that's basically why I'm making this video. I'm making this video because what I have found, um, based on what they said, is is it's either that they're being kind of lazy and they don't want to actually do these things or do the research, and they're kind of sloughing it off on another department. Um, but that remains to be seen. So basically, other in- instances, they tell me to see the attached manuals, which I'll uh, pull up for you. Uh, in two instances. And then the other ones, they basically say that you will get that information from the Department of Justice. So I kind of disagree on some end that that's not exactly what it is I need to do. So I am going to basically take the information I have with the stuff that they gave me and see if we can't uh, kind of give them an indication that I, that, that we feel things are wrong. For example, um, they in they give me uh, policy three twenty four for the Pitt County Sheriff's Office and it's media relations. Now we all know that uh, according to uh, the statutes of North Carolina, that is one thirty two. Um, the very beginning public records defined. So public record or public records shall mean all documents, papers, letters, maps, books, photographs, films, sound recordings, magnetic or other tapes 
electronic data processing, records, artifacts, or other documentary uh, materials, regardless of physical form or characteristics, made or received pursuant to law or ordinance in connection with the transaction of public business by any agency of North Carolina government or its subdivisions. Agency of North Carolina government or its subdivisions shall mean and include every public office, public officer or official, state or local, elected or appointed, institution, board, commission, bureau, council, department, authority, or other unit of government of the state or of any county, unit, special district, or other political subdivision of government. B, the public records and public information compiled by the agencies of North Carolina government or its subdivisions are the property of the people. Therefore, it is the policy of this state that the people may obtain copies of their public records and public information free or at minimal cost unless otherwise specifically provided by law. As used as used herein, minimal cost shall mean the actual cost of reproducing the public record or public information. So that being said, whether or not they have a policy for media relations or media contact, which in this case they do, my point is, is that the records that they have that are public records belong to the people. My request, although they may consider me to be media, holds the same relevancy and um, weight as that of a public individual. So there should be no special instances or special treatment that a, that a person in the media receives and vice versa. We are the same. So I'm going to bring that out. Any agency member who receives a request for any record shall route the rec request to the custodian of records or the authorized designee. Request for records. The process processing of requests for any record is subject to the following. And then they list a number of different things, specifically that no person requesting to inspect and examine public records or to obtain copies thereof shall be required to disclose the purpose or motive for the request. For example, is it for news purposes? Is it for personal purposes? Is it for business? Whatever it should be for, you don't have to disclose that. And finally, in D, it says persons requesting copies of public records may elect to obtain those records in any and all media in which the agency is capable of providing them. No request for copies of public records in a particular medium shall be denied on grounds the agency prefers to make the public records available in another medium. And that is according to NCGS section 132-6.2. So ultimately, I believe that there are some instances that she addressed in her email to me that basically says that she feels that the department will need to be obtained from the department or complaints filed against the department, that is the sheriff's department, will need to be uh, obtained from the Department of Justice. So back again, we, we did this one right here. She told me to uh, see the attached policy manuals. I did. Um, and I'm going to respond to her about that. Policies and procedures in place to, to ensure the compliance with state and federal laws. She said, see the attached policy and manuals. I did again. She said that I asked for the statistics and the complaints filed against the department. She says that the complaints filed against the department will need to be obtained from the Department of Justice. I think that they have some record, and those are the records that I seek to um to find or look at, even if I do so in house. But the but the bottom line is, is that she feels that there's another department that I should go to, or that I should send my request to, that being the Department of Justice, then she needs to forward it to them. And then finally, that the complaints obtained need to be obtained from the Department of Justice and do not fall under NG NCGS 132-1 as a public record. That remains to be seen. We'll look at those things. But ultimately, I'm going to do my due diligence and see if I can basically whittle down exactly what it is I need to ask and find out regarding um, my public record request. And then once I do that, I will either be able to do it in-house directly, face-to-face, -face, via email. And this is just going to kind of get me set up in order to be able to do it in a way that is consistent so that I can do it the same way over all the hundred. You know, maybe it might take me, to, take me two years to do that. But ultimately, my end goal at the end of the day is to see if we can figure out what's how useful body-worn camera footage is 
as it pertains to the complaint. And why do we have to go through such hoops? Why do we have to jump through such hoops in North Carolina in order to receive the footage? So basically, uh, I'll kind of wrap up my investigation starting here or start my investigation starting here and we'll wrap it up. And as, as I get updates, I'll let you guys know. Thank you for uh, checking me out. Um, whether you're on the right, whether you're on the left, um, politically or however you want to look at it religiously, all I really ask is that you meet me somewhere here in the middle. Thank you for watching. If you have a video you'd like for us to cover, use the submit link in the description or pinned comment. If you enjoyed this one, consider subscribing and hit the bell to be notified of future content. Be sure to check out all of the other content we have for your edutainment. We will continue to respectfully exercise our First Amendment rights and published interactions we have with government officials. Remember to like, share, and leave a comment. It's the easiest way for you to let us know your thoughts about our channel. I wanna be the greatest. Everybody on the face shit. I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest. I make this every day and I'm impatient. Hoping one day I blow up from the basement. Statement, the top is so vacant. I don't hear shit that I think is amazing. Waiting for my day when I'm playing. Sold out shows for a thousand faces. Hey, give me that crown. Get in my way and to be put down. It ain't your place, all this my town. If I want that shit, then I'll get it right now. I'm losing it, the noose it fits, some loose shit, a stupid myth. You choose to live or choose to dip, you choose to fight or lose your grip and lose a gift. Oh.